Hey guys, hey guys, J Tom Bassman here. Been a while since I got a video out for you, and uh, I apologize for that, but I want to make up for it and uh, show you what we got in January's Mystery Tackle Box. I know that uh, it's late and January's over, but um, before we get February's, let's refresh your memory, show you the good stuff we got, and uh, what you can possibly expect for the month of February if you guys haven't gotten Mystery Tackle Box before. So. Uh, without further ado, let's get going. And um, some great companies, again, with Mystery Tackle Box. A lot of these companies we've uh, been working with for a long time here. And uh, they keep giving us great baits for, uh, to give you guys. And uh, that's what's awesome about them. So we got a, a Big Bite Baits, great company, great scent. They're actually from Illinois. Um, and uh, uh, this is uh, the 4-inch disc tube by them. It's a 4-inch tube craw bait. Um, great for uh, fishing uh, on beds. Uh, a lot of people use tubes for beds. Uh, I, I use tubes only a few times, uh, but uh, when I have used them, I've had good luck on them. Um, of course, with Big Bite Baits, you get quality plastic and great scent. Um, rig these up on a, a, a tube jig or a Texas rig, and you'd be sure to catch some fish with these. Moving on, uh, missile baits. We got a contest going on with missile baits right now. If you uh, go on Instagram, and um, follow me, by the way, J. Tom Bassman. Um, and if you take a picture of your missile baits, hashtag cruise contest, and you get entered to win a signed uh, autographed uh, cruise jersey. So uh, pretty cool. Um, hope some, hopefully someone wins it. And um, here is their fuse. It's a 4.4 inch worm with uh, craw claws on the end of it. And these uh, entice the bit fish, you know, and uh, get them, get them, get them moving. So uh, this look, looks like it'd be great on a shaky head or a uh, drop shot. Drop shot, yeah. No, I'm sorry, I lost the word. But uh, a drop shot um, looks like it'd be killer. It's in a morning dawn color, great color. Moving on, got some crankbaits here. We got the uh, RC uh, 2RSC crankbait, shallow runner. Um, looks like it has about two feet. Uh, it's by uh, Reaction Strike. They make great crank crankbaits. Uh, had some sharp trebles on there, and uh, overall, great quality crank. I heard a lot of guys catch some stuff on these. I've caught a few. Um, everyone I've thrown is last to me and uh, catches me a fish. So um, this is in like a ice color, so it'd be great for dirty water. Um, moving on, here we have uh, a popper by uh, Lake Fork Lures. I never really knew that they made uh, poppers. This is the Magic Popper. Um, it's in like a rainbow trout kind of color. Pretty cool popper. Uh, I'm sorry, Blue Fire Ice it's called. Then we got a new company, Mr. Wiffle Lures. Got this cool eight inch worm. Uh, it's different because it's a hard plastic. Um, very, very hard, very dense. Probably got a lot of salt in it, it looks like. And uh, it almost feels like a different type of material. Uh, than most soft plastic baits but it's got these uh, holes in the tail that uh, have water go through them and uh, stir up the water um, you can rig this for a top water Carolina rig Texas rig um, different ways you can uh, rig it up and uh, let's move on to the next box here again we got that popper magic popper and a lavender ghost shad the craw tubes uh, the disc tube in uh, watermelon chartreuse, cool color. Um, missile baits, we have another lure by them in here. It's called the Tomahawk. It's an 8.75 inch worm, double twirl tails or uh, curly tails on the end there. It's in a black blue flake. Looks like it'd be killer on a Texas rig. I love Texas rigging, uh, big worms. Always catch some good fish. Um, and then we have a cool thing here by uh, Fish Belly Baits. It's called the Popper Shad. This is like a swim bait or a jerk bait, but it's got a popper mouth on it. So you can rig that thing up and use it as a top water, as like a, a minnow hitting on the surface, you know, 
or a bait fish maybe floating that's like half dead, um, a injured bluegill sometimes they'll float up. So uh, you know, twist this along. It's got a crazy smell to it. Never smelled anything like that before, but uh, it's a pretty cool color. It's I think a neon green, but you can rig this and run this in a, on a scrounger head even. Um, you get a two pack of these. Looks to be about six inches long. And then uh, we get a Eco Pro Tungsten here. Um, they got some nice products. Uh, they were in last month's box as well. I didn't get a boxing unboxing up, but they were in last month. These are the um, what are these here? These are the bedhead jig. This is in a quarter ounce. It's tungsten, so it's smaller. Um, it looks small, but it, it's pretty big. And I just stabbed myself with the hook, so they are sharp. Um, nice little head there. You can rig that fish belly bait up on there, uh, or you can um, put the uh, the fuse from uh, the other box if you got that. So uh, pretty cool bait, or pretty cool hook. I'm sorry. Uh, use these for many different things, many different lures. Um, you'd be surprised the ways that people come up to fish different jig heads and stuff like that. So that was the mystery tackle boxes for January. Uh, we got a cool sticker here, hashtag the other KVD. Um, it's a pretty cool sticker, a new one. And um, I think a lot of people uh, are enjoying that. So let's see where you put yours. And... Uh, until next time, guys, uh, take your mystery tackle box out. Go catch some big ones. I know it's winter. It is horribly cold up here in Joliet, Illinois. Um, negative numbers. We just had school off the last few days because it was just so cold, negative wind chills. So I'm not doing anything but kind of digging through some tackle and working. Uh, without further ado, I'll talk to you guys later. Uh, look out for some videos coming up. I'm trying to get some things going. Sorry guys, be safe fishing. Yeah, we got the fire, 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 and we're gonna let it burn.